Welcome to the iTag SunVisor installation guide. You can achieve professional results with your iTag SunVisor simply by following this instructional video. So, let's get started. Ensure you have all of the materials that you'll need. This includes a lint-free cloth, a tape measure, a box cutting knife, a pair of scissors, a spray bottle containing five drops of detergent that is wax and ammonia free, electrical tape, warm soapy water, and the supplied squeegee. Rubbing alcohol is optional. Begin by rolling out your iTag sun visor in the sun for five to 10 minutes. Meanwhile, thoroughly clean the surface of the windscreen using warm, soapy water. Do not use Windex or similar cleaning products. The sun visor is applied to the outside of the front or rear windscreen. For the front windscreen, it must be applied within the tinted anti-glare region, or the top 10%, to comply with regulations. Do not apply your sun visor over any braking lights. Using a measuring tape, find the center of the windscreen and mark the point with some electrical tape. Align the sun visor with the center mark and ensure it's level. Place some electrical tape onto the sun visor as shown. Note that the tape on the bottom of the visor acts as a visual guide when squeegeeing onto the windscreen. You can do this by measuring the distance from the bottom of the visor to the bottom of the windscreen on both the right and left sides. Begin the application by peeling the backing sheet off from the edge of the sun visor to the center. Once the backing sheet is peeled back, carefully cut it in half, close to the center. Use the spray bottle to lightly spray the windscreen surface. Make sure the sun visor is angled correctly with the windscreen. Squeegee the sun visor onto the windscreen, starting from the center, working toward the edges. Use the squeegee to push the water and air bubbles toward the edge. Remove the remaining backing sheet and tape from the center of the sun visor and apply the other side using the same technique. Trim off the excess pieces from the top and side windscreen edges. Use the squeegee as a guide for the box cutting knife to run along. Finally, firmly press down the edges onto the windscreen with the squeegee. The edges may not stick if your windscreen is too wet. If this occurs, wait until the surface has dried before trying. You are not to use windscreen wipers or demister, nor wash the windscreen for three days after installation. This video was brought to you by Infront Media.